will back things out. Quentin Jackson out of Texas A&M. Worked in against Timmy, and Timmy with the rejection. He made a huge difference on the defensive end with his shot blocking ability. Playing in a tournament that uh, pays some pretty good money if you win that tournament. Gabriel battling and fighting and finishing. Kind of on an island on the perimeter, and that's what led to that bucket. Chris Clemens with that last bucket as Hughes lines up a three ball and knocks it down. We've seen a lot of big comebacks. Nice. Gabriel lays it off the glass that time. The playmaking ability offensively, taking care of the basketball. There's Peak with his first shot. <laughs> see if it does. Heard trailing by 13 here, just under nine minutes remaining in the half. That's Timmy spinning. It's a great hustle by Terry to, to poke it away, keep it alive, and then track it down. Timmy will try a three-pointer and knock it down. With the two ways on the roster and an assignment player. And that's a missed opportunity in transition for the herd. Well, maybe not. <laughs> Five seconds on the shot clock. Inside to Timmy, kicks it to the corner. This is Peak, steps back to the three-point line Woo! and buries it. <laughs> it's just tough to switch him. I mean, if you get the mismatch with anybody playing the one, two, or three on him, and. Wisconsin with the ball, they get it into Gabriel. And Wenyan finishes, and a free throw coming up. Nice job, Timmy. Gortman to Gabriel. Trailing 69-55. Timmy passed up the mid-range shot to get it to Thompson. Assist Timmy. Bulls have led by as many as 20 in this game. Antetokounmpo drops off to Timmy with the two-handed flush. He's had some, some nice opportunities on drives, some floaters in the paint that just haven't dropped for him. Thompson, he'll knock down the three ball on the roster from the Chicago Bulls. And that's really been the difference as Gabriel knocks down the tray. G League has a, a funny way, funny way to finish up these games. As Gortman has hit back-to-back -back shots now. Well, then he doesn't have to be Oh, got hit in the face. We saw a game get away from the herd last Thursday at Motor City, only to see them come back on Friday night. So we'll see what the herd can do on Saturday night against Windy City, and that game will be on the road in Chicago 